The weather headlines lingering snow showers, still a few snowflakes this afternoon and evening. Very little, if any, additional accumulation. We're calling it sprinter spring slash winter here in southeastern Wisconsin. Many people uh, staking their claim of potentially the worst April ever here in southeastern Wisconsin. It does feel like it. All right, storm for max radar southeastern Wisconsin. What's left of our snow very light, very scattered across the area. A few snow showers drifting through Racine, Kenosha counties, one of them just to the west of Lake Geneva as well. As we widen the view here, we are on the very backside of this area of low pressure that's still spinning to the northeast of us and it will continue to work its way out of here. Future forecast as we head on through the afternoon. This is 430, a strong northwest wind wind. It will be windy. It will be chilly. A few flurries and snow showers overnight tonight clearing out by tomorrow morning. I think during the day tomorrow we're going to have a decent amount of sunshine. Still a strong breeze and still chilly temperatures with highs only in the upper 30s. Look what happens by Wednesday. Here comes another batch of mixed precipitation approaching us for Wednesday afternoon. OK, your forecast for today. A high temperature of 36. Windy with some scattered snow showers for tonight. Low temperature of 26 degrees, flurries early, otherwise breezy and partly cloudy. And here's your seven day forecast 38 on Tuesday. Again, rain to a wintry mix Wednesday night into Thursday. We could have a little bit of snow again. We'll have to keep an eye on that. Uh, 45 for your high on Thursday. Friday, we warm up a little bit up to 45, partly cloudy 47 on Saturday. On Sunday, maybe back up to 50 degrees on Sunday with mostly sunny skies. Quickly, I want to give a shout out to Den 3, PAC 119, gave them a nice tour. They were a great group. Hopefully they got a nice badge or something. But again, they were a great group of kids, and we showed them all the ins and outs of the TMJ4 Studios, at least.